In this video, we're gonna show you how to add additional fields so that when users register on your website, you can additionally grab information from them uh, so they don't have to do that later on. Uh, we're gonna be going through step-by-step -step on how to do this, so just follow along and we'll go ahead and get started. Let's go underneath of the membership and we have our roles right now. We'll go to subscriber, because this is the one that we currently have. We'll go to uh, fields. And right now you can see the three fields that we have currently on the registration form. We have username, email, and address. And then we have a fourth one called title. And this is already built in so that we can go through and add that. But right now we don't want to add that. We want to add things like phone number or things of that nature, or maybe even business name. Let's go through and we're going to navigate down to the profile section of our website. Click on edit post type. This is going to allow us to add additional fields to the registration form so that we can collect additional information. Go over to the fields. You can see we have that title field there. Let's go through and we want to add a custom field with a text and we want to name this company name. And I want this to be required. Save that. We also want to add their phone number because we want their phone and we're going to make this required as well. You can add as many information as you want to the site uh, when, for when they log, register on the website. So be sure to just add whatever you need and then you can go from there. We'll hit save changes. We'll go back to our membership and our roles. Click on the subscriber, edit with the voxel. We'll go to fields and we see that we have the company name and phone number field right here. Let's move this up above company name right there. So company name, phone, email, and password. We have all of those options. Adding the description, placeholder, we can do all of that there. And then once we're done, we can hit save. And now that we have all of those fields and everything done, so that we will be able to show that on the front end using the auth authentication form, let's go through and we're going to design that real quick. Login and registration. Let's create that and we're gonna edit the template. From there, we're going to search for the auth. Nope, oh, it's a login. Login register. Click and drag that in. We have all of our different options here for login, preview screen, register. We can preview that there. Uh, we can see that we have our company name and our phone number. We have our login title. We can go through and change all of these if we need to. For the registration, we can manually or automatically choose roles uh, that are enabled. So if we want this to be a subscriber only registration, we can do that as well. Or if we want this to be a business reg registration, we can also make that happen as well. We'll choose auto. And like I said, you can see that we have our company name and our phone number there. Let's update that back. Let's go back to our profile and edit post type. So there we go. Now we can go through and add additional fields to our registration form. Just as simple as that. I hope you guys liked the video. Uh, if you want to, if you have a question, drop a comment in the um, comments below. And I would be happy to help you guys out. And I'll uh, see you guys on the next one.